upload, direct upload, this is a direct upload. This is going to be demonstrating the door hold key switch on the elevator with permission. So pretty much this is an elevator that has the door hold key switch. It's going to take the H2395 key. I had a feeling this key would do it, and I knew when coming back here. I have the H2389 key in hand. I don't think it works, though. Nope, does not work. H2395 key literally does everything. It works on non-Dover elevators, too. Let's put this key in. What you guys are seeing. Let's see? Put the key in. Turn it to hold. That's as far as it turns. Can't remove the key. Holds. No calls. Radium one. Can't close the door. Can't press and hold the floor and or close to get it to move. It will not work. And it will not take any calls either. Even on the first floor, it will not take calls. See? Look at that. That's insane. Now watch. I turn it to the off. The door just moved. Put a call in. Okay, I gotta let it close first. If it's in the middle of traveling to a floor, it will, um, and you turn it, it will still proceed to the floor. Hold. No calls, but the door did move for some reason. I'm gonna I turned it, so I'm going to turn it back. Oh, it started to close. Again, turning it will stop the door. Let's go up to three. I've turned, I've turned it. Door will open like normal. No calls. Watch that. So yeah, that's demonstrating door hold. Now it's back in normal service. Let's do the door trick real quick. So now you're able to see the clutch. Wow. And that's it. It is locked. Oh, you can hear it open. What's on? Here it comes, and that's it.